Hello everyone, Revan Megas here welcoming you to another Honest Discussion. Today I want to talk about the Rune Factory 5 release date for the American audience. Now, I saw that this isn't coming out till supposedly early 2022. And a lot of people probably are going, that's a long time lapse between Rune Factory 5, J Japanese release, versus the American release. And part of me thought the same thing, because the game's not going to be as fresh as it was when, you know, we're seeing all the trailers, seeing the different styles of combat, the farming, the 3D environment, everything that we were seeing from the trailers and the direct plays and all that. And in the back of my mind, I was like, is this too far out? Should this have been in the works being translated, getting out to the masses before, you know, all that luster was gone? And I know personally, I was looking at, I was honestly considering switching over my Switch to the Japanese marketplace to even download it, just to see what all the fuss was about, see how the game was, play it, and really get my hands on it early. But then a part of me thought, as I saw the reviews coming in for the game, heard direct people talk about the Japanese version, that there was a lot of issues in the sense of the game was too easy. I do remember in Rune Factory 3, I believe it was the one on the, or it might have been 4, the one on the uh, 3DS where you were working with the dragon and you had amnesia. I do remember that that one at times had very like ebbs and flows in the difficulty where at times it was you know difficult you had to grind out some levels make sure your gear was up and ready to go and fights were actually hard but what i've heard from rune factory 5 is that that isn't always the case is that for the most part the game is very easy which is a detriment to me I do know that when I played Rune Factory 4, that was the thing I loved. I loved going through the game and having those flows where it was hard, where I had to actually like think up different weapons, see if I could find, you know, grind out a couple enemies to get like a gem or something to like be able to build the next set of gear. And as I look at this 2022 release, I do question and I hope that there's going to be some stuff being fixed in it. Now, one of the, those aspects is hopefully the difficulty will be tailored a little bit more on the difficult side, or at least give us the option to have that more difficult experience. Now, since this was announced, and I do know that this was announced a little bit ago, so this is a little bit later than I was expecting it to come out, that maybe some of these issues have been addressed. The other thing that I've heard is there is a little bit of nuances with the environment that don't look as clean and crisp as they should. Now this area, I don't know if that will really be fixed entirely. I'm kind of suspecting major changes like that won't actually take place. It seems like when it comes to games, it's a little bit easier to tailor difficulty of enemies whether through, you know, stat points, um, HP, that kind of stuff, than it is to create whole new, you know, environments and that. The other thing that I'm hopeful that we get with it being pushed back is there was a lot of pre-order bonuses that came with the Japanese version, including clothing, just including a lot of different, like, custom costumes and that kind of stuff that hopefully we will get maybe included instead of as an additional DLC. So hopefully that's something else that we see. But I do know that this might not be the worst thing in the world. It might actually really improve the game to get this instead of being almost a guinea pig that the Japanese release was. So hopefully we will see a lot of those fixes. Now I know this video is going to be relatively short, I just wanted to kind of give that little bit of discussion 
see what you guys think. Is this something that you should be worried about, that you're worried about that it is being so far pushed back, or is there really going to be an improvement made on this? And I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, please let me know. Leave a like, leave a comment, leave a subscribe. Until next time, this is Reb Mega saying, catch you later.